What's going on guys, it's Unknown Player here and in this video I want to talk about two main things which is a reward for collecting all 50 calcified fragments and this mystery secret exotic which we found in the blueprints kiosk. There have been lots of rumours and discussions surrounding these recently so I want to give you guys my thoughts and possibly some myth busting on what I know. So this of course is the exotic weapons blueprints in the tower and this is where you can pick up copies of weapons you already have or weapons you never had at all that will show up as mystery exotic engram icons just like this one right here which requires discovery. This is my exotic weapons blueprint so you can see I have every exotic weapon in the game is all complete and if we look at the scout rifles with the Boolean Gemini which is a Petra Venge quest weapon, the touch of malice which you get from 46 calcified fragments and the Eris quest, the Jade Rabbit is the PlayStation exclusive which you get from RNG or engrams and the Talarlock is the Warlock Gunsmith exotic and also we have this Mida right here which is the last one and this is from year one of course. I don't have it in year two yet but I can buy it for some marks because I already had it in year one and funnily enough this is actually my first ever exotic ever in Destiny. I got it from the Vortal Glass chest because I had it in year one I can buy the year two version for 150 marks. So if I go ahead and buy this Mida multi-tool you'll notice a mystery exotic engram appears as if this is some sort of new weapon and this is what's been confusing a lot of people recently and only if you buy the year two version of the Mida you'll get this secret exotic blueprint. I want you guys to comment down below with what you think this blueprint is and what do you think is surrounding this. Do you think it's a bug or a glitch or do you think it's an actual scout rifle that exists in the game that has yet to be discovered? There are a lot of theories surrounding this, mostly suggesting that it could be a hidden quest line similar to No Time to Explain or the Sleeper Simulant or even that as a reward for all 50 calcified fragments that we now have or possibly that it's even the Fate of All Fools which some of you might know from year one which is actually a missing Grimoire card but if you don't know the Fate of All Fools is actually the Jade Rabbit. I think the Fate of All Fools Grimoire card only exists because one person in the world has it because they were gifted the Fate of All Fools by Bungie but the Fate of All Fools literally is the Jade Rabbit just reskinned because I think they thought that it looked too similar to the No Time to Explain so they probably thought it wasn't a good idea to have two identical looking exotic weapons so they changed it to make it look like the Jade Rabbit which is what we have now just like the Vesta Dynasty became the Boolean Gemini which we have now. So all of these theories are possible and we can't rule them out 100% because Bungie haven't confirmed or denied that it is a weapon yet. I personally don't think that it represents an actual exotic scout rifle that is hidden in the game for lots of reasons. Firstly, people are constantly data mining Destiny and its files in the armory. If there was a weapon, I think it would show up as a classified exotic, just like the Sleeper Simulant and the No Time to Explain did. We didn't know what their names were and we couldn't see them, they were just classified objects, but we did know that there were these objects in the game files and so far nothing has been found. Everything that currently exists has been accounted for and there's nothing extra that's still waiting to be found out about. And also, if there was a part of a quest line, there would be quest items in the game files as well. Just like the Sleeper Simulant, we had the Icloss cores and we had the codes and all those items but as of now there's nothing new in the database nobody has at least found them yet what i do think this is is simply a bug or a glitch and i think the most obvious reason that it is is because you only see it when you buy the mida multi-tool it's not just there as a normal exotic blueprint it seems to only pop in when you buy the mida multi-tool so it seems like it's a glitch and kind of weird for it to happen it doesn't seem like it's an actual thing that's supposed to happen and it's probably just a duplicate of mida maybe a year one version or a year two with a different icon or probably something like that i think it's a duplicate of the mida that isn't really supposed to be there but hopefully sometime soon bungie will come out and say what it is or they'll just get rid of it in a hot fix which i think is most likely to happen or who knows maybe it is an exotic scout rifle that is linked to the 50 fragments that is definitely a theory that a lot of people are holding on to right now and i personally would love that to happen like scout rifles are my favorite weapon in all of destiny but i just don't think it's very likely as much as it is a lackluster reward i think the beltane shader is all you get for 50 fragments but who knows maybe there is something secret i definitely like i said would hope there to be but i do not think that this is actually a real weapon i think it's a bug but as i said let me know what you think about this in the comment section and uh, hopefully you have enjoyed this video a bit of a discussion and possibly myth busting on what is actually the deal with this missing blueprint hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video drop a like rating if you did be sure to check back for more videos on this channel subscribe to so you miss out and i'll see you guys in the next video